My dear brothers and sisters, we gather today to reflect on the gospel passage from Matthew 26:14 to 27 on this Palm Sunday. The passage begins with the betrayal of Jesus by Judas, one of his own disciples, for 30 pieces of silver. This betrayal is a reminder that even those who claim to be followers of Christ can be tempted and fall into sin. It is a sobering reminder that we must always be vigilant in our own lives, watching for the subtle temptations and compromises that can lead us away from the path of righteousness. As the story unfolds, we see Jesus taken before the high priest and the Sanhedrin, the Jewish council, who condemn him to death for blasphemy. We see Jesus standing alone before his accusers without any defense or advocate. In this moment, we are reminded of the loneliness and despair that can come from being misunderstood and falsely accused. But as Jesus is led to his crucifixion, we see something remarkable. Despite the unimaginable pain and suffering that he is about to endure, Jesus does not resist or fight back. Instead, he submits himself willingly to the will of his Father, offering himself as a sacrifice for the sins of all humanity. This act of selfless love and sacrifice is the heart of the gospel message. Through his death on the cross, Jesus offers us the gift of salvation, a chance to be reconciled with God, and to experience eternal life. But this gift comes at a cost, a cost that Jesus was willing to pay. As we reflect on this passage, we are called to examine our own lives and our own relationship with God. Are we willing to submit ourselves to God's will, even if it means sacrifice and suffering? Are we willing to follow Christ, even if it means being misunderstood or persecuted by the world? And are we willing to truly embrace the message of the gospel, to live lives of love and service to others? Let us pray that we may have the courage and strength to answer these questions with a resounding yes. May we be inspired by the example of Jesus Christ, and may His sacrifice be a constant reminder of God's love and mercy for all humanity. May we never forget the price that was paid for our salvation, and may we strive to live lives that reflect that sacrifice to the world around us. Let us pray that we may be given the strength and the courage to confront these questions and to live out our faith in a way that is worthy of the sacrifice that Jesus made for us on the cross. May we be transformed by the depth of God's love and mercy, and may we be empowered to live lives that reflect that love and mercy to all those we encounter. Amen.